Hi guys, it's Sydney. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. I'm Sydney if you are new here. Today's video is going to be all about jeans. I'm going to share with you guys the best denim for 2023. All of my favorite recommendations for jeans that are really on trend and very current. It's been a while since I've done like my favorite denim video. I feel like the styles have changed so much. Now we're wearing like more low rise, more dark wash and things are just like totally different. So I'm really excited to share with you guys my favorite current denim pieces. But before we get into the video, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. If you really enjoy lifestyle content, fashion content, styling, then you'll really enjoy the content I create here on my channel so make sure to subscribe so that you never miss a video and you can also follow me on TikTok at Sydney Merkazner. I post like a lot of obviously like short form content on there a lot of outfits of the days and just like daily vlogs so I will leave that link down below but without further ado let's go ahead and get right into the video okay these are our first pair of jeans these are from the brand girlfriend denim and this style is called the Bella low rise jeans and I really love these ones because they are very much on style with like the low rise light wash straight leg and also full length and I love that these come really long because I'm 5'7 so it's really hard for me to find jeans that are full length on me they all like are like a 29 inch inseam so I think that these ones are like a 32 inch inseam maybe even a 33 so it's really nice for tall girls or if you're like a little bit shorter you can just like easily get them hemmed but I think that the wash is so nice and the fit of these is really really great like I just got these I didn't need to get them tailored or anything like that which is really rare like pretty much all of my jeans I get tailored but these ones just like fit perfectly right off the bat which is really nice and I got these in a size 28 and they are like a pretty good fit like the fit is almost perfect I do know that these are going to stretch out like a lot that is what the review said but I chickened out on getting a size 27 just because I wanted them to be baggy so if they do stretch out too much I can just like get them hemmed um, but I have been like really loving girlfriend denim lately, especially for this particular style and I've been seeing like literally everyone wearing them and they're just like so flattering and so cute and they come in like a bunch of different washes um, and I got these ones off of Revolve and I believe that they're like maybe 225 so they're pretty steep but it's like honestly still pretty comparable to like a Goldie or Citizens. The next pair of denim is also from Girlfriend. These are the Brooklyn High Rise Straight and I really love these ones. These are a really similar wash to the last ones. I can't remember the wash of every single one, but I will leave everything linked down below, including the washes. But I really, really like this style because these are a lot tighter than the Bella ones, which are basically like denim forms of sweatpants. These ones are tight, so I feel like you can wear these going out or like to work a little bit more. I feel like they're a little bit more dressy, but they're also super long, which I love, so I can wear these with like boots and they look really, really cute. I got these ones in a size 28 as well because on the reviews on Revolve, they like pretty much everyone said that they run really big and these are quite a bit snug. They're not too tight, but the denim is really soft, so I'm assuming it's probably going to stretch out like one size. Um, the fit right out of the box was pretty good there's like a little bit of gapping in the waist but nothing too crazy i don't want it to be like super tight on the waist because then when you sit down it's like really uncomfortable but these ones were also 225 dollars but they are really great quality i also like how for girlfriend the um branding is super minimal all you have is just like this little white tag on the back which I love I hate like a bunch of branding all over my stuff it's just like not my style so I've been really loving girlfriend like I said before and these ones are a really great pair all right the next pair of denim is from citizens of humanity and citizens of humanity has been one of my favorite denim brands for so long I used to wear their rocket cropped slim jeans like all the time back in high school they were my favorite jeans and they had like massive <laughs> rips at the knee but they make such beautiful quality denim and these ones are called the anina trousers and i really really love the dark wash for these because as you guys can see i really love light wash and i tend to always get my jeans in light wash so i really wanted to like switch it up and get the dark versions and these ones are just like so beautiful so i really 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 love the wash on these they're super long they're calling them like a just trouser even though they are a pair of jeans but they do remind me of like how just like a pair of dress pants fit 
but I love the rise on these too. They're just like kind of like, they're high rise, but they just come right to your belly button. So they're not like so high that when you sit down, you know, it's like constricting your breathing or like your ability to eat. So it's the perfect rise for me and also the perfect length. These are really long guys. So when I wear boots, these are like the most perfect jeans. I wore these like on New Year's Eve with my by far boots and they looked really, really cute. I got them in a size 29 and then they did stretch out quite a bit and then I just got the backs of them taken in. So I just like get two little darts in the back kind of like right by on either side of the belt loop and it just like helps so that your jeans don't gap in the back but i still have like plenty of room and that's like super cheap to do it i do it like at nordstrom and it comes out to be like 15 to 30 bucks just depending on like the girth of the denim but i really love these ones these ones are also pretty pricey these ones are 228 dollars but i really really recommend obviously investing in high quality denim because you don't want to have like a bunch of turnover in your closet so i think that these ones are really really great the next pair of jeans is from a goldie they've always been one of my all-time favorite denim brands um and i'm kind of like venturing out you guys know like the 90s jeans were my favorite jeans for a really long time but they were just never long enough for me and that really like was an issue and so I have been like venturing out into different styles. So these ones are ultra low rise jeans, which I'm like jumping on the bandwagon because I am like really not a crop top person. Um, so I don't always need a high rise pair of jeans. Like low rise is fine for me if I'm gonna wear like a full length shirt. And I do really think that it, it, it can be really flattering if you're wearing the right pair. But these ones are called the Wyman Low Slung. And I love these ones. These ones are like your summer jeans, like going to the beach, if you're gonna like wear those like Birkenstock clogs or just like slides, easy summer tennis shoes. I feel like these jeans are perfect for that. I wore them to the beach recently and they were just like perfect. My boyfriend was like, your jeans are so big, like what's happening? I feel like I do <laughs> need to get the waist taken in probably just a little bit, but I just like really like how they look just like really loose and effortless. I feel like it's really reminiscent of like a free people type of style in terms of it just being like really loose, super beachy and nice. And I feel like it's just like a nice switch up to everything that I already have, even though they are light wash, but nobody does light wash jeans quite like a Goldie. I feel like these are just the most beautiful soft pair of denim ever and they're just like so cute so they are just like a straight leg they don't taper at all at the bottom but i like that a lot i think that they're just super flattering like i said just like throw them on go and just like do whatever um i believe these ones are 188 dollars so a lot well, not a lot but much less expensive than girlfriend and citizens but the quality is still there um but i really really love these ones i got these ones in a size 30 um just because i wanted them to be low rise i mean they are low rise but you really have to pay attention to your measurements depending on the rise like obviously this part of my waist is a lot smaller than this part so i always really pay attention when i am ordering jeans i have like my measurements saved on my phone so i like will look at the rise and see where i need to be i probably could afford it to get a 29 but also my thighs are a little bit thicker so i always just like go with a bigger size and tailor it and it ends up being okay our next pair of denim is from levi's and i have a lot of vintage levi's that i love a lot but for the sake of this video i only wanted to show you guys things that you can actually buy but my favorite type of vintage levi's is men's 501s and those just like seem to fit the best and they're super on trend and really cute so if you want to find a pair of vintage levi's i definitely recommend that you have 501s but these ones are the levi's dad jean i think they're now calling them like the baggy dad i got these last year and they were just like called the dad jean but i got them in this black wash and i think that these are like some of the most flattering jeans that i own they're again just like super loose and easy to wear so that's very nice i feel like that's now like my jeans vibe like I don't know how I was able to wear such tight jeans back in the day. It's just like so uncomfortable and like sit in the car and drive. I just like I could never do that. So all of them are just like super loose and oversized. These ones are in a size 29 and I did get the waist taken in on these ones. Um, I think that they're supposed to sit 
a little bit lower but i feel like there's like a lot of room in the crotch area so on my particular body type i have a, like a pretty short torso they are a lot higher on me they come above my belly button but i love the leg of these as well they're super long so they look good with like any shoes that you want to pair them with and they also are wide the whole way down so they're straight leg but i feel like they are a little bit wide they're not like the citizens where they're like a complete wide leg but they are a little bit wider so they're just like obviously baggy and i love the price point of levi's they're only 98 bucks so it's like a really really good price point i feel like for what you get and they have these in a bunch of different other colors i just got the black because I didn't have a pair of black denim and these ones are the 32 inch inseam I know that they come in a 30 inch inseam as well but 32 is um, perfect for me this last pair of denim is kind of like an honorable mention these ones are also from citizens but for some reason I feel like they either renamed these or they just like dropped off the surface of the earth but I still really wanted to share these because I love them so much and I feel like you can probably get them like pre-loved on Poshmark or Depop and you'll get like a way better price for them but these ones are called the Emery long jeans and these ones have been like my go-to pair of denim for like the last year and a half i got these on sale at aritzia for like 99 bucks and it was such a good purchase these were like my first kickoff pair of jeans that like actually fit me full length so i was like really excited when i tried these on in store um and i got these in a size 29 they are full length these are just like a beautiful beautiful light wash and i feel like as i like try on all of these i can really tell like which denim is the softest and i feel like it's by far citizens like their denim is thin but not in the sense where it like feels cheap it's still like really nice high quality 100 percent cotton but it still just like molds to your body and fits a lot better there's so many jeans out there that are 100 percent cotton that i just could like never wear even with being like so aware of my measurements and everything like that but i love these ones so much i've been wearing them all the time i will link a really similar pair down below for you guys because i think that they did get renamed and I think I saw like a really similar um, pair on Revolve. And then I just also wanted to say on these that these ones are more of a low rise jean as well. They hit below the belly button, so I suppose you could call that like mid rise, which is starting to become the rise that I am gravitating more towards just because I feel like it's so flattering and you can wear it with like a really different wide range of tops and I feel like it looks good with every single one versus like high rise if you're wearing like a long shirt and you have to like you know pull it down like that like that's not really that cute so I really like the rise on these I think they're probably like maybe like a 10 inch or like 11 inch rise so I really really like that all right you guys that was it for today's video that was all of my current denim favorites I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video leave it a like and a comment and I will see you all in my next video bye guys